Most communities in Hesse collect organic waste separately from general garbage and use it for composting. But organic waste collected in the so-called brown bin contains a remarkable amount of energy too. In 2007, the county of Wetterau, north of Frankfurt, started to explore this energy source. The county enlarged its existing compost facility with a special biogas plant which ferments organic waste. The plant is run by the company Wetterau Composting, a joint venture of the municipal waste company and the machinery cooperative in the county. 300,000 residents are hooked up to the system. Two-thirds of the organic material is collected from brown bins, one-third as green waste from private gardens. It is, however, a difficult material to use in biogas production. The amount delivered, consistency and energy content alternate. It contains hard and knotty material and often plastic or pieces of metal. Before biogas can be produced, it has to be crushed, cleaned and sorted. Here in the Halle, werden the bioabfälle angeliefert. Insgesamt 30.000 Tonnen pro Jahr werden zerkleinert. Die Zerkleinerungsmaschine ist wichtig, dass das Material für die Biogasanlage vorbereitet wird. Auf dem Sieb hier werden die vorzerkleinerten Materialien getrennt. Das feine Material, was hier runterfällt, bis 60 mm Größe, ist das, was viel Energie hat, was in der Biogasanlage verwertet wird. Der grobe Überlauf wird energetisch verwertet im Bereich Holzkraftwerke. About 50 tons of sorted organic waste is used as fuel for the biogas digester daily. It has a volume of about 1,600 cubic meters and inside it looks like this. With its strong stirring device, the plug flow digester can handle material with a high percentage of dry matter. The fermentation process takes at least 14 days. The operating temperature is 55 degrees Celsius. This ensures that pathogens are killed off and weed seeds will not germinate in the compost later on. The gas fuels a combined heat and power plant with a 600 kilowatt engine. In December 2007, it began delivering electricity. Ja, das war eine logische Ergänzung. Das Kompostwerk ist 1993 gebaut worden. Damals war die Technik für, zur Biogaserzeugung aus Bioabfällen noch nicht gegeben. Und in den letzten Jahren hat sich sehr viel entwickelt. Und seit die Technik jetzt ausgereift ist, haben wir dann den Erweiterungsschritt gemacht, damit die Energieproduktion aufgenommen und auch mehr Material selbst hier aus dem Wetteraukreis dann verwerten können. The engine produces heat for the digester, the buildings and, via a heat exchanger, it is used to dry wood chips. The sticky residue is pressed. The fluid is stored in a fertilizer tank until fall, when it is spread on the fields after the grain harvest. The liquid fertilizer is handled by the machinery cooperative. Three transport tanks and a slurry spreader with drag hoses. This is a practice with particularly low emissions. The liquid fertilizer is rich in water-soluble nutrients and due to fermentation done previously, it is virtually odorless. The solid part of the residue is mixed with fresh green and composted further until it can be used as a soil conditioner on local fields or sold to gardeners. In total, the fertilizers from the compost facility replace more than 100,000 kilograms of nitrogen per year, plus potassium and phosphate. The Wetterau composting plant only uses existing waste disposal systems for its energy production. To generate a comparable amount of bioenergy would otherwise require about 300 hectares of land.